How's it going, guys? This is the Spanish dude. Well, today on news, looks like DirectX 12 drivers for NVIDIA graphics card has been released. It is only a beta driver, but it will support GTX 600, 700, and 900 series graphics cards. Now again, this is only for people who have nabbed and grabbed the technical, technical preview build of Windows 10. So what do you guys think? Are you gonna grab the new drivers? Have you tried Windows 10? Comment below and let me know what you think. People are saying that DirectX 12 will be a huge um, increase in gaming. Maybe? I don't know. But Nvidia is already preparing for its arrival. So it's done a beta. If you guys have Windows 10 and trying it out and you have a um, Nvidia graphics card, you should grab it, test it out. Let us know in the comments below what your results are. Also today in news, uh, looks like Deep Silver has announced that Dead Island 2 will be delayed until 2016. Now I quote, they said, we have been looking at the game long and hard and we have decided we didn't reach the goal we set out to achieve quite yet. This is why we have decided to delay Dead Island 2 to 2016. So, I think, here, here, here's, here's what I put, I think this is good, because not only, I guess, in a way they saw, wow, like, um, uh, Techland just made uh, a great game without us, yes, again, Dying Light did have its issues, but once fixed, I thought the game was fantastic, um, also, this is good, it's not only about competition, but this is also good, because this will give, um, a general idea that this game actually might be good they're actually taking their time to create a fantastic game for us and I mean for the general consumer this might be good results but what do you guys think I mean should should it be good results if they're waiting this long or will we get bad results would it be greatly optimized comment bottom let me know what you guys think about this delay are you guys stoked for dead island 2 uh is it just another zombie game that everybody's been playing or do you think it's bringing something new to the table comment below let me know and last but not least it's time to talk about the witcher 3 now that is coming out may 19th apparently cd project red um, senior artist has claimed that there is no loading times in uh, Witcher 3. Uh, Jonas comments that fast travel loading times depend on how far you will be traveling of course. So there is loading time when you fast travel. Um, but he says other than fast travel and the first time you boot up there will be no loading times. I think this is a great idea for this game. Um, I know a lot of people have been wondering about the loading times because they did say that <coughs> Witcher 3 was going to be a bigger map than Skyrim. Um, so I think I'm excited to see this. Um, I can't wait for the game. Again, I have mentioned it a couple of times in my other videos. What do you guys think? Are you guys stoked? Are you guys excited to pick up Witcher 3? Let me know in the comments below what system are you getting it for? Are you gonna get it for PC? Are you gonna get it for PlayStation? Are you gonna get it for Xbox? Are you guys excited? What do you guys think of the no load times for the game other than uh, the first time you boot up? Um, do you think this game might be the next uh, game of the year or the next big hype? Um, so let me know in the comments below. Subscribe and like. Okay guys, well that's all I have to say, uh, enjoy some gameplay video, I am playing it on the Lenovo uh, laptop that I got, the Y50, uh, it's just Dark Souls, nothing big, so hope you enjoy, take care.